everybody, welcome to Flat Cap Fedora Presents. I'm your host Mark, and today is May 12th, 2020. This is the evening show for 2020, May 12th. I like how I did that, huh? So, last week we saw we had the question out there at the bottom of our screen. What's better? Barbecue done via charcoal, Traeger, or propane? Well, we're still waiting on some more submissions. But so far, it looks like Traeger beats them all, and that's my personal favorite. Running next to charcoal, which is great, but sometimes you can't get that fire lit up the right way. However, there will be people who will tell me it's easy. I offer the chance for anyone who wants to uh, compete against me as I use my Traeger and they use their barbecue grill to do so. And bring me a plate of food, and we'll see. Okay, it's just a shameless plug for me to get some food. but. More importantly, uh, at the end of our last video, we did have a chance for five lucky seniors to get their pictures taken. So far, we do have one senior scheduled for this Sunday. And if you have a senior who has not took their senior portraits yet, we're giving, still have four, four of those packages away. Um, remember, anyone could ask for it, we're, ha we're handling it pretty much within the Fresno County area. And to be more to the point, please be respectful of you who already had your pictures taken. That's great, wonderful, I'm happy for you. But give a chance to someone who may have not got theirs done for whatever reason. Sometimes it's scheduling, sometimes it's other reasons. But whatever the case may be, those offers are still out there. Please direct message me or call our office at 559-460-3075. I'll leave a message if we're on the other line. Now, as for today, we're going to talk about what to do when you're at home with your kids. Last time I showed you the drive-in, but this time we're going to make a movie, which is the other side of the coin. See how that works? Drive-in, watch a movie, now we're going to make one. So. In this time of COVID and all the stay at home stuff, how do you get people to model for you? Well, if you have your kids, you can put them as the main character, which is always fun. But if you don't have that, or your kid wants to learn how to make a movie, the better method is use something else, something in the house, like a toy. This particular toy is a transformer. And this particular toy I use to do a little 20 second video doing stop motion. Now, you're gonna need your toy and you're going to need something to shoot it on, a camera. In this case, this is a Pentax Q10 with a lens on it that comes off of a, what we call C-mount, which you find for security cameras. Now, you also need one more thing, aside from a flashlight or any type of lighting, and that is a backdrop. In which case, if you have a computer, use your screen. Now, the flatter the screen, the more matte finish, not glossy, the better. Now, next week, I'm going to show you a whole, do, a whole segment on how I actually do one. But this week, I'm going to give you the teaser. My 20-second film's already done. I'm going to attach it to this video so you can see it. Now, next week, we'll go over this. Again, I do this as a living. I'm a photographer and among other things. And I love doing photography and videography, uh, cinematography. And I like teaching people how to do it. Everyone has a different view of the world and everybody sees things differently. And what better way to get families closer together than to have them do something creative. Making a movie, doing a podcast, doing a vlogcast, or transmit on Twitch, which is why I've been helping my son do on his Twitch channel Unicorn Sniper 56. Hopefully I got that right. <laughs> so he'll be broadcasting tomorrow on there. But either way you look at it, right now, yes, we have to stay at home, but there are lots of fun things to do. So let's show you that footage, and then we'll get back with our Dog of the Week. So, this week's 
dog of the week is Raider, and Raider comes to us from Second Chance Animal Shelter in Selma, California. Raider is a boxer pit bull mix. Raider loves people. A little selective on dogs, but he loves people. And you'll get to see what Raider looks like shortly, because the people, the good people over there at Second Chance Animal Shelter sent us a video to kind of give us an idea of how Raider is. Now again, Raider loves people. He's available for adoption, but he is selective with dogs. So if you already have dogs and looking to adopt Raider, it's advisable you give a call to the Second Chance Animal Shelter. The information will be at the bottom of, of the screen and in our links. So, that concludes today's broadcast for May 12, 2020. We will see you two days from now on our live broadcast on Thursday, May 14th. And we hope that we can all be safe, be good, and take care of one another. Have a good night.